Hi and welcome. This is Drifter Maniacs and this is the next part in my uh, Sprint 2 uh, Drift Mods video. Uh, I've just fitted a uh, one-way uh, differential to the front of the car uh, to improve its drifting capability. What difference does this make? Well, conventional diff at the back. Wheels turn either way. Um, at the front now, ooh, they're locked. They won't turn backwards. Uh, so they've just been on the front rotation. Hopefully this should uh, improve its drifting capability. Uh, this is the um, the HPI part in question. Um, I've not done a how-to video on this, predominantly as it took so long to fit it to the car. Uh, it's also because I fitted the uh, the new shiny HPI Universal um, uh, wishbone, uh, dog bones on here. Um, unlike conventional uh, dog bones, which are here, uh, that are in two pieces, uh, the universal dog bone uh, is like a little um, almost bowl shape in here and the pin is locked in, doesn't pull apart like this. Uh, it does have greater articulation, so the angle uh, of the steering is greater than this, which is one of the key reasons uh, why I bought them. Um, the reason for that is that at some point in the very near future, hopefully tomorrow, I'm going to zoom in here, uh, I'm going to waste this part back here so when the steering turns it won't stop there. I'm going to cut into here and increase the steering angle uh, which is one of the benefits of uh, fitting the, uh, the HPI Universal Dog Bone uh, part. It also leaves me with a spare differential uh, which I'm gonna, gonna in the next video on the Sprint 2 Drift Mods uh, I'm gonna show you how to lock this and then I'm gonna fit that back on to the rear of the car. Well, um, let's give you a little update on my Sprint 2 uh, Drift car uh, on the mods. If you like this then please do subscribe uh, thanks for watching and good night. Uh, I hope you liked this uh, video. If you did, please give us the thumbs up and do subscribe using the link below.